down, ladies and gentlemen, three three-minute rounds in the welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the Mission Corn Hall, Blue Corner. He stands six foot one inch tall, weighing in at 166 pounds. Tonight, making his debut, fighting out of 11 in Virginia, John Colson. And now his opponent, fighting out of the Gold Spectrum CVD Red Corner. He stands five foot ten inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. His record, one win and zero defeats. Fighting out of Greenville, Tennessee, Andrew Burr. The referee of the action begins, Nate Jolly. Did he give us a heat and sizzle that time? And we are here. Come out with a nice little leg kick from Murr. Colson with the return. Yeah. Chandler, I'm excited, man. First MMA bout of the night Absolutely. here. Absolutely. You know, this is this is where I live, man. Nice little kick right there. He caught it, but he got his leg back. Nice little right hand. Uh, Murr slipped it pretty well, though. Good little inside leg kick right there. Nothing crazy right now. Ooh, tagged him with that left hand. Great action here on Spectation Sports. As we get you ready here for our pro MMA action coming up very, very soon. Andrew Murr. Out of the right corner there in the black with the red trim there in the all black. John Colson at 11 in Virginia, not too far from here. Two up, two down. <laughs> One of the O's has to go here. Neither one of these men have tasted defeat in their career. And, you know, I mean, I, I know it probably feels like an eternity ago, but there was a time when you were an O and O fighter back in the day, man. What, what are Absolutely. those jitters like? What are those butterflies like? Uh, you know, those were decades ago. I don't know. <laughs> decades. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, it was a... Uh... <sighs> Man, as an amateur, it's like you, you still, you're not really on top of the world, but you feel like it because your community and everybody looks up to you and stuff. So uh, it's a good feeling. And, uh, you know, these guys are going to, you, you'll you probably see more great out of them, man. When, you, you're, when you're fighting just for pure fun and your legacy and stuff instead of money, it's, it's a little different. Kind of like college football and NFL, you know. Yeah. John Colson looked for the takedown, unable to get it. And now Andrew Murr is making him pay. Murr bullies him into the corner. The one thing that you got to, uh, you know, uh, definitely look for is how is Colson's cardio going to be? You know, he took the fight last minute. So hopefully he, he stayed in shape, man, and, and we get a good fight because he's definitely tough. You can look at him right now and tell he doesn't care to stand there and get hit. Uh, Wish could come back to bite you in the butt. Well, Chandler, blood has officially entered the room here. As you see, busted open is the nose of John Colson, man. Baptism by fire tonight in his first MMA bout. Ooh, nice little right hand. Colson trying to blast forward there with the big straight right hand. Nice little underhook right there to stop that takedown. Uh, ooh, nice little right hand. Another right hand. I think he shook him a little bit. He needs to work the underhook and definitely try to keep this. And that is where we will leave it. Round one in the books is Andrew Murr. We are right here at the Meadowview Convention yep. Center in Kingsport, Tennessee. As it is the first bout of 2022 for Showcase MMA. And you can expect a full slate of fights all the way through this year. As I'll tell you, Showcase has really stamped their name as the premier pro-am show here in the region. I mean, nobody else is touching this. When you talk about the amount of fights, the quality of fights, and the excitement here, every show, awesome. Whether it's in Tennessee, North Carolina, South Carolina, they are always putting on great fights here at Showcase. Absolutely. And, uh, you know, they do such a great job with the fighters as well. Uh, and I may be a little biased, <laughs> but I'm definitely a, a, a huge supporter of this organization and what Casey and Brandon's been able to do for this region. Just done an absolute tremendous job here. And 
Not to toot those horns, man. Those guys, you can see the proof of the hard work and uh, the fans coming out in droves tonight here in Kingsport. And how about Andrew Murr, man? You can tell that he's been inside of the cage before, that he has that experience. Absolutely. Nice takedown by Murr. And right now, th this is what we call a little scramble right here. He got the unhook under the leg, and look at that. Now, John Colson, that was great defense by Colson to get back up to his feet. Andrew Murr, strong with the takedowns. We saw it at the end of round number one. He's trying to pick up another one and perhaps bring this thing down to the mats where he feels maybe he has a big advantage over Colson. That time out of the clinch. Here's another right hand, and Colson may be done. He definitely landed it. So. Good opportunity for a guillotine here as Andrew Murr. I mean, he is dig he's throwing his neck out there for Murr, but Murr's not taking it, Chandler. Uh, absolutely, like and you know, he's trying to finish, uh, he's trying to work across the body the wrong way. The, the way that his head is, he needs to cut that corner and finish the takedown on this other side. Uh, Missed opportunity here for Andrew Murr, who uh -huh. lit him up with two monster right hands and uh, really staggered Colson. But this has given Colson an opportunity to kind of recover. Yes, and... Uh, well done by Colson. And, and, and not too sure uh, if this kid wrestled or not in high school, but Lebanon over there in that area, man, they got some good wrestling. Absolutely. And, uh, and that's why I question, you know, his wrestling seems to not be amateur, you know? I mean, it is amateur, of course, but yeah. uh, not... Immature man, he seems to be getting in the transitions and definitely be working real well. That right hand right there, uh, definitely caught him. One thing that I, I've noticed about Andrew Murray though is his hands are down, and it may be because of the, how comfortable he feels uh, with maybe uh, Colson's power, maybe. But yeah, uh, the later these rounds go, the easier it gets. Man, these MMA gloves are, are super light, and it don't take much. So. Uh, that's one thing that I'd, I'd watch for right here is with those hands down, you know, what what exactly could transpire? You know, you, you look at it and you look at three minutes and you don't think much of it, but when you're throwing this hard, and now Colson once again on wobbly wheels, Andrew Murray using that power trying to move to 2-0. That's, uh, that's one thing you can't do in MMA. You cannot turn your back to an opponent. Uh, that, that is when bad things happen. That is when bad things happen. Another solid round here at Showcase as our first MMA bout is delivering in spades. Let's take a look at the replay, Chandler. Coming out of that clinch, Andrew Murr landed another right hand. He that right hand and landing. He's loading it. And there it is again. Now that one, I thought... So he's definitely working it, man. And, you know, he's eating a lot, and it shows his toughness. Uh, but he's threw back some as well. Uh, and it's one of, like I said, it's one of these sports with these small gloves. Anything can stop a fight. Anything. So, I mean, he's not out of it. He's still throwing hard. Uh, I don't know how his body feels, but as far as like being gas, he's not too. I mean, he's not tank. You know, he's not tank. He's still in there. There's still a. There's still a, that that puncher's chance. What well, tonight awards, right? I mean, we have not got a fight that has been you know really finished here outside of that first original grappling matchup. All of our kickboxing matches have gone the distance. And right now, it looks like these two are gunning to get to the end of this fight. Can they go all three rounds? Only one fight between the two of them. I mean, we're talking very inexperienced, but very, very tough. He has to quit turning his back, man. That's, that's, that's just the inexperience, though, uh, you know, in this game. And it'll come in time. Andrew Murr being very, very patient, looking for another opening. And I always liken it to, to video games, right, where you get that blinking red bar when you're just about to get knocked out, just about to be finished. And I feel like Colson is right there with that blinking red life bar right now. He's not feeling it, man. He takes an unintentional low blow, 
on top of that, I still think he's a little foggy and a little shaky right now. I had to take the five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Inexperience, right? I mean, Inexperience. I had to take the five minutes, man. Sometimes it's, it, you know, let's say that at their main event uh, with Brandon Cowton when he got hit in the Jack Swagger fight. Yeah. He's like, F it, right on national TV. It's, uh, you know, sometimes, man, take your five minutes, man. You get a minute in between around that five minutes, though, boy. That's a, that's a break. Oh, Ooh, nice little right hand. Right hand. Loading it up here is Colson. Colson swinging for the fences, trying to pull off his first amateur win. Nice little left hook. To oh, right Andrew Burr with another bomb shot. Uppercut for Down days. Down goes. This one's got to be over. No. Hanging out for tier life is John Colson. And I thought we had that one finished. And this is where the fatigue's going to set and in. And this is where Andrew Murray can back up. Let him get back up and shut him right back oh, down. Absolutely. And he get a stoppage. Those body shots are going to take a toll, especially when you're just fatigued. A nice little scramble right there, but you got to finish that. If, you don't, if you're going to hit it, you got to finish it. But he's allowing Colson to stay in the fight, oh Chandler. Oh, gosh. That's inexperience as well. <laughs> well. He's going to go back and watch this tape and be like, man, why did I not back up? I had him finished. That all comes in time, too. And that little wrestler transition kind of kind of gassed Murr out a little bit. And they're both gassed at this point. So right now, it's a puncher's chance. <laughs> oh, look at this. Andrew Murr. Nate's always going to have to step in. You just can't cover up like that. You got to throw back. Colson hanging off for dear life. Andrew Murr has it finished. But Colson with enough heart to make it potentially to the end of this fight to go all three rounds. And this dude is in autopilot right now, man. Right his now, body he is just hanging on. Wrestling one-on-one. -on -one. If he was to take his left leg right now, hook that leg, get around, take down. But that just comes with the experience, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, absolutely. But good. What a fight, man. What a fight. No, you know, a couple of very guys early in their career showing a lot of heart tonight here in Kingsport. I look forward to seeing both these guys get back inside of our cage. Oh, Welcome absolutely. to the replay, Chandler. Absolutely. So right here, you know, uh, Murr threw that left hand and kind of rocked uh, Colson. Colson regains himself, but then gets hit the left hand. That right hook misses him barely. Pushing his cage. Throws that right hand right there, and this uppercut comes right on the chin, drops him, and instead of finishing him, he he hits him, he he uh, closes the gap and lets uh, Colson in on the takedown. Not bad, not a bad fight at all. Uh, there's some, just some inexperience which happens in the very in the in the amateur uh, scene. This is exactly why we fight amateur, is so that we can fix these problems now, and then your record and everything restarts when you go pro so uh kudos to these guys what a good fight uh to start off the mma portion of this card and just more to come and now we got cyrus walking up the cage and we're going to turn it over to him All right, let's make some noise for both fighters. Join the distance for you tonight. We go to the judges' scorecard for the decision. The judges see the fight 30-27, 30-27, and 29-28. All for your winner, by unanimous decision, Andrew Murr. Andrew, come on over here, man.